On this episode of Weekend Rental, we take the bow and make a stand in Shaolin vs Wu-Tang. This 2D fighting game pits legendary warriors against each other in a loving send-up to the tradition of martial arts cinema. Let's take a quick look at the action before we get to our reviews. Let's see. All right. All right. All right. All right. Who do we got? Who do we got? Okay, I'm player two. Okay. I'm we'll actually just... not sure if it's loading or if it's just breaking. Breaking. True. Mm. Oh, okay. Whoa, Thank okay. happened. Yeah. All right. Well, this is doing work. This is definitely so far, a game. This is a straight up fighting game. This is a straight up <laughs> video game. These loading <laughs> screens, though, I don't know. Uh, the bright yeah. white, it's doing it for me. Yeah. <laughs> so if you hit Y plus forward or back, you do this like evade thing. Oh, it's like a sidestep, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> I guess it's got iframes. Like. So there appears to be a super or like EX or something. Yeah, there's there's a meter. And I think the yin yang is something else. Can you build meter? Like, is there like a charge? Maybe? Well, if I could figure out how to do specials, it would probably build meter. Why does it not say your name? It just says your name is Wrestling and your name is Capiera. Because if they yeah. use their real names, yeah. they get copyright infringement. I'll be right so, back. they are all quarter circle Street Fighter style, and then supers simple are stuff. super input, or simple inputs. Oh, oh. AB. Huh. Yep. Wow, this is... Combo. Uh... There's combo break? Oh, wait. Uh, Throw. Okay. I like this weird rain level. Makes everything look bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like a camp tunnel, right? This rain yeah, is like following <laughs> really sporadically. Like slow like, and fast at the same time. This. <laughs> you gotta take a nap. <laughs> it's chill. Ooh. There's that dog again. Whoa. Oh, These are really cool. These little cinematics. Yeah, <laughs> they like, yeah. totally work for me. It's super jerky though. This game has a really good rating. I just was messing around with that. It's got like a 9 out of 10 on Steam. Really? I guess people are getting what they want out of it. <laughs> uh, I guess I am, I guess. Well, you just broke some watermelons. There's a little bit of uh, environment destruction here. Ooh. My weekend is saved. We got a game. Yeah, we're in it. We're renting. I like this music. <laughs> yes. Yeah, the music is cool. The dog is cool, too. It's crispy. Oh, is that crouching tiger? Oh, yes, totally. Oh, okay. Ooh. Wow. Your palm will not beat my fist. <laughs> <laughs> Holding back. Oh, that, oh no. Get Ooh, off. Ooh, yeah, good one. Yeah. Oh. Who's who right now? I am the guy who just uh, fell down. <laughs> I mean, why wouldn't you be the ninja? It's a good question. He has a sword. Ninja now, huh? But he doesn't have beads. I'll be this Chad guy. Kickboxer. Yeah. Kickboxer Chad. Super Chad. <laughs> oh, shit. I think he may be supposed to be Sean Claude Van Damme. Oh, Jesus. We got a sleeping cat in the background. Yeah, we do have a sleeping cat. <laughs> I like <laughs> that. <laughs> cat can't be bothered by this fighting. Yeah, bored pets. That's a. <laughs> He's totally disinterested. Theme of this game. You just slap him away. That's so good. <laughs> Maybe they only hurt if you're in the middle of a move Ow. or something. So like real life. Or they're for stun locking. I think I like this game a lot. <laughs> Which one are you, Morgan? I'm uh, Jean Claude. Oh, word. Damn, damn. Oh, you yeah. mean Mr. Yeah. Kickboxing? <laughs> Mr. Kickboxing. <laughs> the name thing is a big miss for me. They, uh, oh, maybe they can't call him like Van Damme. Right. right. That makes sense, right? I mean, I'm oh, kind of into uh... it in the way that it's like, uh, you know, the, the sort of constant trope in a Kung Fu movie is like, my kickboxing is better than your ninjutsu. Yeah. You know what I mean? God. They identify more by their uh, style than yeah. their... The... Oh wow! wow. Lot of it out. Yeah, it's nin ninjutsu. So. It's hybrid. <laughs> <laughs> it's, 
Okay. That's what ninjas do. Tarp uh, Low kick to death. Come on. Oh, nice. Oh, Johnny caged me. Yeah, yes, certainly. This guy on the right, he was uh, in a Drunken Master type movie. I don't know if it was. He might have been in Drunken Master. The guy who trained Jackie Chan. I like those portraits. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, the stages yeah, think... are just beautiful. <laughs> I dig it. I can't stop looking at them. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I should be paying attention. Yeah. Oh, you're paying attention. Oh, whoa. whoa. We got the super. I spanned That's it. Awesome. <laughs> it's like a movie. Ooh, this See how good you are. The spear I got looks pretty, pretty long. Wow. I'm digging this like Western it could kill music. Me. Not that long. <laughs> Not that long. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Okay. This crane fist probably has some aerial stuff going on too. Oof. Oh, nice. Ooh. Brutal. God. Why is it so long in the air, but... <laughs> <laughs> crane style, baby. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. Ooh, the specials are really <laughs> very gratifying. My face was great. <laughs> it was in, oh my god. Right for the wrecking. Uh uh. Ice cold. That would be really cool. Oh, good win. Thank you. That that uh that weapon is ridiculous. Yeah. <laughs> What Chuck Norris? What does Chuck me, Norris have for make weapons? Me use my eight diagram fist. Uh, I don't know. Do they all have weapons, or is it? Yeah, just, uh... X X is weapons. Maybe it's just his oh, fist. His oh, fist. it's brass knuckles. <laughs> He's got brass knuckles. Oh, he throws them on real quick. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, you went high. I thought you were gonna be sneaky. Oh. Nice. You you withstood my eight diagram fist. <laughs> Somehow. Somehow. Oh, oh, got oh. the sweep, got the sweep, Ooh. got the other sweep. <laughs> this is Mortal Kombat 2. <laughs> high low, high low. Hit him with the schmicks. Oh, oh you always went on the air. Nope. <laughs> the t oh, no. oh, I can't do my nice shot. Oh, oh, no. fair. <laughs> that was very close. Oh, he's got the Dapmo spade. That's my favorite kung fu weapon. Oh, I got nunchucks. Sick. All right. Oh, it's a spade. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want. I don't Jesus need Christ! To know that. I just started doing that special move like 20 minutes before you jumped into me. It just wouldn't stop. <laughs> I still jumped right into do it. Do it again. Yeah. Do it again. Like what? Well, it's crazy. It's like a. Like this is one thing. Just keeps going. Yeah, that's, that's Bruce Lee. Yeah. <laughs> Hit him with your hot dogs. <laughs> don't you dare. Don't you hit me with them hot dogs. I'll Slap never them with them hot you. dogs. <laughs> there we go. Those are the feet. I saw the shoes. I saw what size shoe you wear is written on the bottom. That's how you're gonna. Ooh. That's a secret. Ooh. Footsie. You're gonna turn this thing around. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, oh, that's some damage right there. Oh. Wow, look at the. Oh, oh. no. Oh. Punish the jump in. Oh, special. Well, I like his hair. I like my boots. Yeah. I got like cool snakes uh, on them. I've seen the. That I've seen all of these kung fu movies on YouTube. <laughs> you can, if you look them up, they're all free, but it's just. If I just put a YouTube slider under this. <laughs> yeah. Will you I watch see. it? <laughs> yeah. A oh, link. It's like three pronged uh, one. Like a link of hot dogs. Yeah. Uh oh. oh no. Oh, <laughs> wow. wow. That, did, that did a lot. Yeah, I thought that was going to get you. It got me. Wow. That was dope. That get slide. me, get me, but it got me. That slide kick really yeah. carried me. This weekend, I start off the reviews. Cool, yeah. So Shaolin versus Wu Tang fighting game on Steam. I picked this one up on a whim. And I'm pleasantly surprised with what I'm seeing here. I thought it'd be a lot jankier than it is. 
but it's got a lot of heart. Uh, it, it draws from a lot of different kung fu movies and represents a lot of different fighting styles all in one game in, uh, you know, competently distinct characters. The animations do waver a bit between excellent and janky, meaning that, like, it's easy to read or it looks... Some, some things look just off-kilter and strange, but it's mostly... Uh, you know, in the spirit of kung fu movies. Um, I think there's some stuff to be desired in, in graphics and music. It's mostly good. It looks cinematic, but it also kind of looks cheap. And I think that's due to it being a budget game. I think there's a lot here that, you know, it, it could be improved in a sequel or if they did like a super edition. Uh, but I don't think this game's gonna topple Street Fighter Tekken or anything like that. I don't think it wants to. I think it's a casual oriented fighting game and it does it pretty well um yeah I, I would buy it and i keep it around but um you know maybe just mix it in between more polished top tier fighting games if, if you want something different yeah so what did you think stove so i uh, came into it wanting to tear it apart because it, it kind of you know uh kind of an unknown thing kind of uh very generic looking menus and, and styles to begin with but Actually, a pretty competent fighting game. Kind of fun, kind of ridiculous. It does a lot of stuff that I, did, I didn't expect to do that a lot of uh, more expensive fighting games do. It has a really weird look to it that I kind of find endearing. Um, it kind of has this weird uh, style to it that makes it almost look like a movie. I, I don't know how they pull that off or if it was intentional, but it works regardless of what it is. Um, the actual fighting game paces deliberate kind of kind of broken but deliberate you can at least figure it out um i have absolutely played worse fighting games than this and not to knock it you know but this game is fun it's really cool and i would absolutely play this again um so yeah gonna hand it off to uh mo to tell you mo what's up um yeah i liked it too um it was pretty fun uh, but like while playing it, I was just kind of like, oh, this reminds me of Mortal Kombat or like, oh, this kind of reminds me of Street Fighter. And then I just started like, oh, I kind of just want to play that. <laughs> but like with people, especially people who like fighting games, it's a lot of fun. So I may have rated it kind of low for graphics and, you know, the sound mixing is atrocious in my opinion. Um, but, you know, it, even though it doesn't have, you know, good, good graphics and it's kind of clunky, it's, it's still unexplainably fun to me. Um, I also feel like it's kind of named wrong because it's, I don't know, just because uh, it kind of spans through all sorts of, you know, kung fu and martial arts movies. And it's not just like Shaolin vs. Wu-Tang, so it was a little bit confusing in that aspect. Um, but it's very charming, and I would definitely rent and play it again. What do you think about this game, Neosense? Hi, yeah, so I loved this game. This game got a 4 out of 5, 4.5 out of 5 for me. It's a buy, buy, buy. Um, it's casual, which is a plus for me. It does some things that are... At first, it looks uncanny, maybe even a little idiosyncratic. But after 30 minutes of play, it shows how truly charming it is. The music... When the music was good, it was more than good. Downright uh, wonderful. And there's all these odd, charming aspects to it. Uh, namely the disinterested members of the the backgrounds in, in the stages. And yeah, they should have played up the fact that this is a fighting, like a martial arts movie fighting game. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna get this game. I think it's super fun. Uh well what about you, Diamond Time? What'd you think? I I'm I, I err on the side of uh Neo sense with this one. This was a big old buy for me. Um, I am not a fighting game player. I'm bad at the these games, generally speaking, but they are a lot of fun for me. And especially ones like this being the sort of um, dilettante kung fu head that I am. Um, 
<laughs> you'll you'll find that uh, I'm maybe throughout the video I'm I'm pretty regular like oh I'm familiar with this but I don't know what it's called and that was a really exciting aspect of it for me I think that people who are maybe even a little bit more into kung fu um, would would be very into it I I liked the fact that um, I don't know was, at first I was somewhat put off by it as, as I think uh, more than one of us were where the names were just the styles but I kind of liked that that was what they were emphasizing and of course there was some uh, licensing issues there that I'm sure they were trying to avoid but um, big big buy for me um, the sound which some folks didn't like I loved I think that the fact that it was a little bit bad in certain objective ways um, were reminiscent of kung fu movies in general and uh, I, I just loved it. I thought it was great. I was bad at it, and I loved watching it, and it was fun. Big buy for me.